Hey, what's up everyone? Welcome back to another episode of Seek and Destroy. And today we have another prequel short from the upcoming Midnight Suns we're gonna do a reaction to. And this week it's Ghost Rider. I'm so, so ready for this one. Uh, ever since they announced these shorts, I was excited for them. But when I heard they were doing a specific Ghost Rider one about Robbie Reyes, I got very pumped, obviously, and I want to see what they talk about, if they bring in Johnny Blaze. They mentioned him in the first episode uh, when the caretaker was talking about Johnny being the one who is in, you know, in possession of the Darkhold right now because she thinks it's safest with him, but her and Stephen Strange and Scarlet Witch and others have to go maybe retrieve it now so they can battle Lilith with the Midnight Suns. And then last week we did an episode where they did uh, Scarlet Witch and Magic, which was really cool because I'm a big fan of those characters. But we're here. We're at Ghost Rider. I'm so pumped. And I think that means we got probably Blade. We'll have one, I hope, uh, coming up. And then Nico, most likely, from uh, from The Runaways, will hopefully have an episode as well. So without further ado, because this just dropped uh, just really just a couple hours ago. So I want to check this out and record this, you know, get this uh, edited and posted as quickly as possible. So you'll probably see last week's episode and this one back to back. So if you have any comments, let them be known down below and we'll keep talking down there. So here we go. Hell on Wheels. I love this intro. I know I said this in the other two episodes, but it's so good. You got the page of the dark hold, and I just love seeing everyone in this animation style, too. It looks really good. Ah, oh, Blade looks so awesome. So does Ghost Rider. Oh, that's so cool. Yeah, obviously I'm kind of a traditionalist with Ghost Rider. I like him on the motorcycle, typically. Dan Ketch is my favorite, but, um... I've grown over the years to like Johnny Blaze more too, but I do like Robbie. I actually think he's a really neat character. And uh, I like Alejandra too, so I'm not like a hater of really any Ghost Rider. If there's a Ghost Rider involved, I'm excited. Um, and then of course we got the other heroes like Spider-Man, Captain Marvel, Iron Man, stuff like that. Uh, they And Wolverine, they all pop in. And then we have the Hunter, who we get to design when we play the game. So I think they're being kind of ambiguous of whether the hunter is a man or a woman, because we get to choose that when we play the game. But I know typically in their promo stuff, they have her as the female version of the hunter. Um, but I think we have anyone out there, who, they make their own character, basically. So, I'm gonna have to work late tonight. I was delayed on my way in. Oh, wow. So this animation style looks kind of similar to last week's, but the first episode had a different animation style. Oh, you notice Robbie has two different color eyes. That's cool. Oh, he's being followed by someone. I love his car, man. It's very L.A. Hey, heard about a car like yours in this uh, <laughs> neighborhood? Uh, yeah. Look very <laughs> similar. Uh, but the one I'm talking about, the whole thing was on fire. Look at that. His license uh -huh. plate. Thing is, I think it says "angry it's for you." Him maybe. Him oh yeah, put him in a hospital. Sorry, man. Haven't seen any burning cars. Oh. Why don't we change that? Game. I got oh. <laughs> I know, I know. We should never go looking for them. Oh, that's Sometimes, awesome. Brother, the fight comes to you. And he's talking to Gabe, his brother. That's cool. He's like, I know I told you never to start a fight, but don't walk away from one either. Uh, that's cool. So he's like, let's do it. <laughs> you guys wanted a car on fire? You got it. Oh, I do. I gotta say the the animation style, although it's similar to last week's, it works for this. I just thought they were gonna. Maybe there's some subtle changes, but I thought they were gonna change the style every week. Um, but maybe I misread that somewhere. Oh man, really, dude? You think that gun's gonna help you? Look at his face. He looks so cool. Oh, oh, you're done. He's got to evaporate. Come on. Oh, they didn't show it. There's no way he's still dragging him. I liked what they did in the Nicolas Cage movie, the second one, when he, like, threw the chain, it wrapped around someone, and they would just, like, evaporate into ashes. Oh, what? Dude, he just opened up a port. Oh, my God. <laughs> that dude, that dude fell right into that pit. Oh, look, it's already getting dark. I saw someone's video on, like, Instagram the other day. It was, like, daylight savings time, and it was, like, 4.59 p.m., and it was bright outside, and they're, like, 5.01 p.m., and it was dark. Uh, 
Get him, Ghost Rider. Oh, that's so cool. That looks so good. Oh, I love it. I love it. Nice. Oh, you guys screwed up now. Oh, that guy's done for. The driver, I think, died. Or maybe he got knocked out. I don't know. I don't I mean, if it's PG or whatever, PG-13. Oh, look at that. Oh, that's his super move from the game. It's like the pen and stare. No, they're dead. Yeah, no PG-13 about it. I mean, they, they edited around it, but oh, okay. yeah, he dead. <laughs> the worst role model. Nice. Dinner's in the fridge. Don't forget to charge your chair. And if you do your homework before I get there, I might be willing to share a bowl of double chocolate fudge. Nice. Love you, Gabe. Yeah, that's what I like about him, too, the brother relationship, because that reminds me of the Dan Ketch, Johnny Blaze stuff, you know, where it's like, it's a brother looking out for another brother. Um, oh, portal. Save your strength, Robbie. You'll cool. need it for the fight ahead. I told you, I wasn't interested. And I told you I'd be back with a friend. Ooh. Whoa. Is she one of the X-Men? Yes, she is. <laughs> I want you to know just how serious my offer is. No, my brother needs me. Don't you want your brother to learn who you really are? To see you, both parts of you? To know you fought for what truly matters. Oh, that's no cool. Hero. I'm not looking His reflection in the hood of the car, that's so I cool. Need a midnight sun. I like that. I don't need a hero, man. I need someone who will light everyone on fire. <laughs> nice. All right. There we go. We got some game footage that'll play out here. Um, awesome. I mean, yeah, it was really cool. It's very simple. Like, it's just introductions to these characters. But I like that there's a little bit of lore there where he's like, look, you tried to come recruit me before, and I said no. Um, why are you trying again? And she's like, yeah, well, the stakes are very high, dude. Lilith is here. And uh, I think she would have maybe said, like, look, you coming with me will help your brother. That's probably what she should have said to get him to come along. Um, because, yeah, it's like, yeah, all right, fine. We'll put someone outside to keep an eye on him, you know, check in on him. But we need you in the battle. Because if Lilith takes over, you know, your brother will succumb to her evil as well. Like, he'll just be another victim to her evil. So that would have made him probably join. But uh, eh, maybe that's stereotypical or cliche to say that to him. But I, that would have got him to come along, I think, easier. Uh, but also having magic show up yet. Yeah, it's like, hey, maybe he fell in love a little bit. <laughs> His heart skipped a beat. He was like, whoa, okay, what's up? Um, which that would be cool. I think in the game you can kind of play that up, like relationships between characters, depending on who you interact with more, um, kind of like a Mass Effect thing. So that's neat that they, they put that in there um, because, uh, yeah, I want to be friends with Ghost Rider. <laughs> and, like, I totally want to hang out with Ghost Rider. So, um, yeah, this is neat. Another cool short film. Very well done, I thought. Um, animation style, I was shocked. It wasn't a huge departure from because from episode two to the first one, those were very different art styles. This was similar to the second episode. So I don't know if the rest of them are going to be like this or if they'll go back and forth or, or what. Um, but I still think it worked. And that shot at the end with his reflection being the Ghost Rider reflection in the hood, that was super awesome. Um, but those are my thoughts. Let me know what yours are down below. And if you're excited for this game, I will definitely be getting it and streaming it over on Twitch. Or I might even just play it fully on my gaming channel, my YouTube channel. I'm still figuring that out. Um, but either way, I'll try to bring some of the footage and a review of the game possibly to this channel. And whenever the Venom DLC comes out, we'll probably play those on this channel as Venom vlog episodes next season. So uh, so yeah, so stay tuned for that. And subscribe if you're into more Midnight Suns stuff. We will cover a lot coming up between the game, the novel, the art book, uh, the comic books. Like, we got a lot of Midnight uh, Sun stuff coming up. So be sure to stay and check it all out when I post it. Thanks so much. See you in hell. Peace.